please consider becoming a patron of the Ramen Raider. Patrons receive special benefits like bonus videos, voting on the Patrons' Choice Top 10, and early Top 10 list access. Visit patreon.com slash the Ramen Raider and become a patron today. Thank you. All right. Hey, this is Hans the Ramen Raider coming at you with another episode of Instant Noodle Recipe Time, the show where I show you what to do with your instant noodles. And today, I've got one that was sent by James from Lakeside, California. This is Wei Wong's Instant Oriental Noodle Soup, Chinese herb ginseng flavor. And what's rad about this is that I've seen this a million times, but I've always thought that it was something I already reviewed because there I've, I've never seen these packs outside of the five packs, and I've just kind of I don't like to buy five packs. You know, I only on rare occasions will actually purchase a five pack because I have to like find a home for them. Know? So anyways, this sounds good and it's nice because apparently James buys five packs and now I know what's in this five pack. So thank you to James. Big sachet. Uh, what we got in here? got a uh, oil sachet I'll drop in too and there we go is it just oil or is it seasoned oil that's a good question eh, it's like sesame oil all right that is a plus. I like sesame oil. And how long are we going for? We're going for... Let's cook for two to three minutes. So we're going to go for three minutes on that. So yeah, yesterday uh, I was talking about how I had to go get balloons. So I got a cake. I got tr a trash bag to put the cake in. And I got balloons for my little girl for her birthday. And once that was all done, I carried it all home. And I also had another bag of groceries. So, but it went it went incredibly easily. So that was a plus. I I kind of try to push the push the barriers of uh, what to do with uh, walking plus groceries or how to pull that off. Uh, if, if I have the option, I'd rather walk than get a ride for anything. I mean, granted, if it's like I need to go to the store and get some uh, tofu puffs, that's going to be a long walk. Uh, that's going to be like four, maybe three or four hours, I think, walking to get to where I can do that. From Kenmore to 99 Ranch in Edmonds. And then there's a good chance they won't have the tofu puffs there so I don't know one of these days I'll do it I go, I go on pretty pretty long walks I don't mind walking three or four hours but generally at the end of that three or four hours I'm home and uh, not facing a three or four hour walk home so. but yeah she's really stoked she's coveting her balloons her big brother Miles wants to play with all her new Hello Kitty junk. No, Miles! No! Ah! She had the the nerve. <laughs> this is funny. She got all her presents, and she's like, "Uh uh, Papa. Uh uh, more, more presents, more presents now, please. More presents, please." It's like, uh, well, lucky for you. In eight days, it's Christmas, and you get birthday 
Uh, then Christmas, so... You're gonna be okay, kid. But, I mean, wow. As my wife likes to put it, three going on 16. Hold on, Mimi. She's very, very much into being served. That's cool, you know. She's, that's what I'd say about kids. Doesn't matter what the kid is. They're in training to be an adult, so... They're gonna make some social mistakes. They're gonna do some silly things here and there. That's fine. That's why you're called a kid, so... But... Alright. Uh, so I'm gonna try this now. I'm definitely getting a sesame oil scent off of it. There's a little piece of... Oh. This looks like... Wolfberry. Interesting. Man, I left this fork in here too long and now it's super hot. Well, let's give these a try. So like I said in the last one, I'm going to be doing more actual revealing of the review process and scoring in these videos. So the noodle's nice. It's a very soft noodle, light tooth. Uh, the broth has a nice body to it. And it's very much an herby one. A lot of ginseng flavor. A lot of wolfberry going on there too. I like it. It's... It's fascinating to me. It's it's definitely a lot different than a lot of the noodles I've had in the past. Which is a good thing. Because I love trying new stuff. I'm dropping some beef in here and I'm going to return it to a boil, by the way. Um, for that one? I like it. Is it blowing my mind? No. But I like it. That one, to me... This is the hard part. Because it's like, usually this is a process I do all on my own. All very ponder, 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 ponder. It's like those uh, game shows where like, okay, talk, you just talk through it. Talk through it. It's like, uh... Like, like one versus 100 or the the one with the briefcases is that it I don't know. but anyways uh i like this i'm gonna give it 3.75 out of five i would have liked a little more on the veg but honest i don't even know if it really needs that just just the flavor and the noodle yeah that's a 3.75 and some of you might go oh wow well, that's not a very high score actually that's that's a decent score and most things that i review get a three and a half Think of it this way. Think of letter grades, right? Three and a half, 3.5 stars is a C. Multiply it by two, then by 10. Um, for a 3.75, that's like a mid-range C. But this is like, it's not blowing my mind. It's not horrible. Looking at it from a range of zero through five, it's on the upper end. Looking on it from a letter grade score, it passes. So it's however you want to look at it with those, you know, because those numbers, they can go both ways. Anyway, hold on, Mimi. Hello Kitty Lollipop. I ain't buying no more Hello Kitty stuff this year. We are done shopping for Hello Kitty. 
absolutely, positively, done, 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 little guy. We got more presents on the way for you, but we are done. I'm not buying you anymore, Hello Kitty. <laughs> she did pretty good. She is not want for toys, that's for sure. And I know for a fact that as soon as Christmas is done, she's gonna like steal all the Miles' toys. She does that all the time. She'll just like grab a toy he's currently playing with, run off with it giggling, and then not understand. It's like she doesn't understand why he's like running after and trying to get it back. She's like, no, no. She literally sounds like a cross between a, like a psychopath and Smurfette. It's really weird. She gets all freaking hysterical about it. No, if you heard it, you would be like, oh, wow, yeah, that falls under that category. Um, that's a word that I don't like to use often because you don't usually hear the word hysterical used for men. I'm not trying to be sexist or anything. But she actually does uh, exhibit... <laughs> It's hysterics, you know. Sometimes Miles does too. I'll admit in my life, I have exhibited certain levels of hysterical behavior. Usually it's something is so funny and hysterical. But, sure. Just want to make that known. Because that's, that's a word I don't like to use. But she, she does show that definite definition correct correct word usage there folks trust me okay egg let's get nice and cooperative only got seven days till Christmas and then it'll be over and then hopefully everything will settle down happiness will return to the kingdom Christmas is a stressful time of year. Yeah. Good little egg. Yeah, I'll give it three and three quarters stars. That's a hard part too, because I usually don't do this until I'm actually typing up the review on www.theramenraider.com, the website that people on YouTube seem not to have any idea exists. Um, <laughs> But there's over 3,000 reviews there. In fact, this is going to be what? Review number 3,471? Yeah. So go over to my website. God. If you click on junk over there, you know, that'd be kind. Oh, black pepper. Happy black pepper. A little bit of... little bit of this. That's good. I think we're going to call it a day on this one, folks. We got a little beef. We got some egg. We got some spring onion. We got our mung bean sprouts. We got a little bit of black pepper. I used black pepper on the last one. I just, usually one I don't commonly use. But it just seemed like it's a, it's a herb. It's, a, it's an herb. This is an Abe's one for Abe's. All right, let's rotato it up. Right, Mimi?
All right, well, hey, this has been Hans the Ramen Raider wishing you enjoyment in your noodles every day. And uh, I'm good. That's two reviews for today. I'm out. So, yeah. Sooner. Bye.